Listeria scare has turned into a huge recall of bagged vegetables at stores like Walmart, Whole Foods, and Trader Joe's. No one has gotten sick, but a Canadian food inspector found one of the company's products was contaminated with the bacteria. So, who is keeping our food safe? Good question. Heather Brown breaks down how recalls work. Whole wheat waffles, curried chicken salad, papayas. We may hear about food recalls every few days or so. In the paper or on the news. But they happen far more often than that. The FDA reports 265 so far this year. Just because there's a recall doesn't mean someone got sick. No, not at all. Mm -hmm. Recalls happen when there's a chance that someone could get sick. Sarah Brew is a partner at Fakery Baker Daniels. She specializes in food law. Most of the time, consumers don't hear about them unless there is a foodborne illness outbreak, there are illnesses associated with them, or if it's a really well-known brand. The majority of recalls come from the food company, whether it's the manufacturer, distributor, or the store. It's the FDA's job to oversee it. The FDA is not coming in and uh, legally forcing me to do a recall. Mm -hmm. Now, FDA does that sometimes, but that is extremely rare. Almost all recalls out there are voluntary recalls. Even though the people lose money, they come out in the long run saving money and saving people's lives. Most food producers and most restaurants want to do the right thing. Mm -hmm. And if they learn that there's a risk, they're going to do a recall. The most common reason, allergens. A food has milk or eggs or nuts that wasn't on the label. It could also be listeria, salmonella, E. coli recall. What do the grocery stores do with it? Do yeah. they just throw it out? It depends on the type of food. Most of the time they do. They can't just throw it away in a dumpster mm -hmm. because they don't want people to get, to get this product and eat it. Mm -hmm. And that has happened. So the FDA might require a receipt from a landfill to put bleach on the food or to send it back to the manufacturer so they can be sure it's gone. Heather Brown, WCCO 4 News. You can see the full list of recalled vegetable products at wcco.com slash links.